First, you could send video messages using FaceTime or other messaging apps. Then Zoom changed the way companies were able to hold business meetings. Now a new app beams someone to another location to talk to someone virtually in their home or office. It's an app launched just a few days ago. They say it could change the way you talk with loved ones who are far away. Our consumer technology reporter Jamie Tucker has a closer look at this new app called Beam. Beam is a messaging app that uses augmented reality to virtually place the sender in the room or surroundings of the person getting the message. The idea is to beam the person into the room through their smartphone camera. It's as close as a hologram as you can get with just a smartphone. Snapping the phone into place, you'll need to place your phone somewhere steady. I'm using a smartphone tripod. And when you're shooting your beam, it's important to be in the shot full frame from head to toe. Then record your message. Hey, Brittany, I wanted to see if you and Mike wanted to meet us for dinner. We're going I'm sending to this beam to my friend Brittany, who will get it so in her text messages. The app then captures your recording and sends it to the metaverse. Hey, Brittany, it's the video Jamie. recording places me virtually in their living room. How fun is that? Beam CEO Janosh Amstutz explains in his Beam message, space. virtually it appearing in my studio. I can move around, move up. closer, and it's just like he's More here. You can beam your fitness instructor onto your terrace for a workout. When you're in the room with someone, the conversation, I feel like, can be different. Um, sometimes I feel like a lot can get lost in translation with messages, so I feel like it could be a great way to have conversations with someone and feel like you're together instead of apart. If you want to try it for yourself, scan this QR code. I've recorded a video where you can watch it in augmented reality wherever you are. Uh, right now, you can record 15-second messages, but the company says in the future, you'll be able to have two-way conversations live. I'm Jamie Tucker, and Beam is the app of the day.